Good morning students today i am here with the video of chapter 7 simple movement of sprite let us have a look on the contents of this chapter contents are creating a new project changing the appearance of a sprite how to make a sprite say something repeating actions adding sound children in the previous chapter you have learned about scratch components that is how to open scratch and make simple projects using blocks from math portion and pen block menu in this lesson we will learn about changing the appearance of sprite changing color and size repeating actions making sprite say something and adding sound effects in a project the blocks in the pen block menu allow the sprite to draw lines on the stage change the color and thickness of lines All the instructions related to the movement of a sprite are given under the motion block menu. Scratch is one of the easiest computer languages. Children can use Scratch to create their own games, animated stories and projects with great ease. The default sprite of a Scratch programming is Cat. It is a small character graphic character that performs actions in a scratch project creating a new project open scratch window click on file menu choose new option a new project opens with a default cat sprite see on the screen screen the default sprite is cat an orange cat so let us move to the next content changing the appearance of a sprite the looks block menu controls the look of a sprite that has nothing to do with changing their clothes when you start a new scratch project it begins with a cat sprite the looks block menu controls the look of a sprite to change the appearance of a sprite we have to follow given steps click on costumes tab the new costume op options are displayed These options are choose costume from library, paint new costume, upload costume from file and new costume from camera. Here we will learn to choose costume from library. Click on the choose costume from library button. The number of choices will appear in the costume library dialog box. Select the animals folder from category section. Select butterfly 1 as sprite and click okay. Observe that the new costume will be added under the costumes list as well as displayed on the stage. Select the scripts tab and click on the motion block. Drag out the move ten steps block from the motion category and drop in into the script area. Click inside the number box and change the steps value from ten to twenty. Now select the looks block category. Click and pull out the change color effect by twenty five block onto the scripts area. Place it below the move twenty steps block. Now pick the next costume block and snap it below the change color effect by twenty five block in the script. Click on any of the blocks to run the block stack. Observe the sprite changing its costume and color. Note that the script tab and the costume tab share the same space. A user moves back and forth by clicking on each tab at the top. The change color effect by 25 block changes the color and other graphical effects applied to the sprite by the specified number. So the class the new costume options how many are there? 4 and what are they? Cost co choose costume from library, paint new costume, upload costume from file and new costume from camera. See figure 7.3 costume di library dialog box and figure 7.4 selecting options in animals folder. How to make a sprite say something? The say hello block allows the sprite say a word or a sentence in a bubble. Let us make project on it. Click the looks block category, drag the say hello block from its drop it onto scripts area. Select the control block category and drag drag the wait one seconds block to the scripts area. Again, select the looks block category and place the say hello for two seconds. This block allow the sprite to say some message for the specified number of seconds. 
click on any of the blocks to run the block stay again select the looks block category and place the say hello for 2 seconds block beneath the wait 1 seconds block now type the message how are you inside the text space of the block drag out the say hello block again and drop it at the end of the script change the text of the block to i am good click on any of the blocks to run the block stay class here you are seeing the green flag now it is a tiny icon placed at the top right corner of the stage screen clicking on the green flag will run the script step by step and one also a circle a red button this this is stop button the stop button is placed on the top right corner of the stage it is red in color and is used to stop the project at any time during execution so class which block we will use to make a sprite say something say hello block now repeating actions blocks held inside the repeat and block are repeated for the specified number of times mentioned in the block let us learn to use it in a scratch project pick this repeat and block and pl place it onto the scripts area change the value from 10 to 15 drag the turn and move block from the motion block palette and now drop them onto the scripts area now place them inside the repeat block click on any block to run the stage no more about control block see here forable block blocks held inside the forable block will be in a loop that never ends unless the stop button is clicked to run a script when flag clicked block is in the events block and the most used block in scratch the image of a flag shows how the block is connected with the actual green flag script that begin with this block will run once the green flag has been clicked to move a block anywhere in the script area click on the top block of the script and drag the stack to the place where you want to place it a loop is a sequence of instructions that is repeated until a certain condition is satisfied repeat instructions help in controlling the execution of the program we can repeat the actions of the sprite as many times as needed we will get various blocks to repeat the action in the control block category where you will get in the control block category so blocks held inside the forever 10 blocks are repeated for the specified number of times mentioned in the blocks so don't forget two blocks forever and when flag clicked these are under control block adding sounds make the script by dragging out the blocks and stack them on top of each other click on the script to play the project you will hear a sound of the cat that is mew and drum beats two sound blocks are play sound mew until done and play drum 48 for 0.2 beats play sound until done block will play the specified sound the script will pause until the sound has finished playing play drum for beats block plays a drum sound for a specified number of beats you can change the drum type by clicking the drop down arrow next to the number and change the number of beats by changing the value in the beats block so class with the help of the sound blocks we can add sounds and drum beats there are many ways to add sound to our scratch projects according to our need we can insert the sound and the drum beat in our scratch project here we have selected the default sprite na this is cat and how the cat speaks mew so we have used mew for the, uh, for the default sprite but whatever sprite we are using in our scratch project we can use the sound we can insert the sound and the drum beats according to that particular sprite so class what what is the which tab we are using to change the sprite's look costume tab and to insert the sound sound tab now let us have the look on the difficult words of this chapter 
First is costume, C-O-S-T-U-M-E. Second is library, L-I-B-R-A-R-Y. Third is category, C-A-T-E-G-O-R-Y. Fourth, repeat, R-E-P-E-A-T, repeat. Fifth, control, C-O-N-T-R-O-L, control. Sixth, script, S-C-R-I-P-T. Seventh is events, E-V-E-N-T-S, events. Eight is pen block, P-E-N-B-L-O-C-K, block. Ninth is specified, S-P-E-C-I-F-I-E-D, specified. Tenth beats, B-E-A-T-S, beats. So difficult words are, first costume, second library, third category, fourth repeat, fifth control, sixth script, seventh events, eighth print block, ninth specified and tenth beats. Learn these difficult words. Write down in your rough copy at least five, five times. And also make sure you are not seen from this. Learn it and then write it. Now brand developer, fill in the blank. When you start a new start scratch project, it begins with the dash sprite, which is sprite cat sprite. The dash block allows the sprite to display the given message in a voice bubble. C block allows. The stop button is placed on the top right corner of the stage. Dash block allows the sprite to wait for the specified number of seconds. Which waits seconds. The dash block will play the specified sound, pausing its script until the sound has finished playing. Which one? Play sound until done. Fill in your book, this brain developer. Thank you for listening. Thank, thank you children. Go, go to this video. Learn whatever is taught in this video. Thank you.